What's up? It's Christopher Stowe Fox Media, and you all know what I'm going to talk about. It has returned. So basically, uh, Xbox One price cut has returned. Uh, they came out there and they made a statement saying, building off a record-setting holiday, we are excited to announce a new promotion in which fans in the U.S. can buy Xbox One at a special price of $349 starting today, basically. And they're thankful, blah, 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 blah. We are desperate. Now, I know a lot of people say they're not desperate. Yes, they are. They're so desperate to win because I know last time they were losing about $50 million over that last promotion, and they're going to do it all over again. But so this time they're going to do it in the United States. And that's it. They're willing to win by losing, and that makes them smart. Now, I didn't say that they you know, were stupid. I said they were desperate. And sometimes desperate makes you do things to win, and they're going to win at this point. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I know a lot of people are like, well, you know, it's going to end. No, it's not. It's never going to end. So basically, they have announced that it is no end date to this whole entire thing, and they are framing it as a promotion rather than a price cut, which means that they can cut it and get rid of it but they're not going to they have no end date on it they saw what works and they're working with it i'm sorry they're doing what they need to do you cannot hate on that so what i can say is what's sony gonna do right now their hand is being forced because basically phil mccracken came out there and he busted out a new promotion that is going to beat the crap out of playstation 4 i'm sorry they're gonna lose so what are they gonna do uh, so there's a report or some rumors going on that basically they're going to announce a PlayStation 4 Slim. So we all know that, you know, uh, right as of right now, Sony, uh, well, Samsung has been cranking out all types of uh, one gigabyte GDR5 chips, and it will fit perfectly inside the PlayStation 4 Slim. And, you know, right now they use a total of 16, uh, 512 GDR5 chips from Samsung. So if they go up there, it will bring down the cost in various ways and probably bring the cost down to the system to $299. Now we're talking. Now we're talking. Because basically Microsoft knows that Sony is broke. We all know they broke. They ain't got no money. We all know they're eating those syrup sandwiches, mayonnaise sandwiches, sugar sandwiches. What are the broke ass sandwiches do they make? The sandwiches with the government cheese that never melts and you can't cut through it. Block is hard as hell. But we all know they're eating it right now and Microsoft knows it. So what is PlayStation 4 going to do and when are they going to do it? No one knows because as of right now, no one knows what the hell is on Sony's mind. What are they doing? What are they doing? What are they thinking about? Good luck, Sony. Good luck. Now, moving on from that news right now. Now, this news is shocking. Apparently, PlayStation 4 owners watch 2.6 times more porn than those on Xbox One. You heard it right here. So, yes, uh, based on the research data from a Sugar DVD app on PlayStation 4, their owners watch more porn than those on Xbox One. And, yeah, this is the data. Apparently, PlayStation 4 owners' top categories are amateur, big butts, Asian, college, and feet. Oh, those beautiful feet. Those, those sexy feet. Look, I'm not going to talk about this, okay? I'm not some pervert doctor who wants to talk about this crap. Well, I am. Hi, I'm Dr. Fox Crosby. And I'm here to talk about... Your PlayStation and Xbox experience. Now, many people will go for... Vaseline... But it won't really help. What I recommend is uh, Nivea Smooth Sensations. It's properly balanced to help you achieve Well, that's all the news I got for you guys today. Uh, I will be doing another giveaway this Sunday, and I'm going to change the rules up just a tiny bit because originally just writing a comment was so easy. I just didn't like it. 
Uh, I wanted to make it a little bit more interesting, basically. It's going to be the same little format, but basically I'm going to change it up just a tiny bit. So all you have to do now, uh, when I post a picture, it's going to have a random question. It's going to be so easy, a person could just figure it out. That or a phrase or something like that. It's going to be like, what's one plus one? And then you have to send me the actual message to my inbox because I'm probably going to uh, record it and then play it for people so they can see when it first shows up. So, yeah, it's going to be something really, really simple, like so easy a caveman can do it like it's going to be something really simple like that but you got to send it to my actual message box so go to my facebook page and like that right now and follow that because i'm going to do it this sunday probably at the same time at 5 p.m mountain time so just look up the time in denver so like subscribe follow me on twitter and facebook so you know as soon as my news becomes available thank you guys for watching and i will holler at y'all later